everyone it's Monday afternoon and as you can see I'm out in the forest I'm just having some quality time taking some photos and shooting some films <sighs> it's so nice to be outside like this first of all I just wanted to say thank you for your beautiful response on my previous video where I took an ice swim or ice bath I don't know really what you call it it seemed like a lot of you liked the video and that you felt inspired and that's what I wanted to do with the video I wanted to inspire you not only to take ice swims but you know to get out there to, f to face the things that keep you stuck if you know what I mean after I took the ice swim last week, I have felt so good. I have not been freezing at all. It's really true that taking ice swims can be really healthy for you. Actually this morning I was walking down to the lake with my dog and I just felt this urge to take a new swim again. <laughs> so from now on I'm gonna take ice swims as often as I can. I would love to do it like once a week but at least once a month I will do it. So I was inspired to start with the ice swimming by Wim Hof, the ice man. <laughs> if you haven't heard about him, you should check his channel out. I can put a link down in the description, but he has a lot of interesting films on his channel and I, I always feel very inspired by people who, you know, prove that we can do so much more than we think. Because we really can. I know that. <laughs> so yeah, I think you should check him out if you want to feel more inspired about this subject. So it's Monday today and I haven't done a vlog in a couple of days. And that's because it's just been a lot of things happening. <laughs> we have been really busy. But yesterday on Sunday, our friends Osa and Arvid and their kids came and visited us. They live in the neighborhood village about 30 minutes from us and they came to help us fixing a ventilation system in the smithy. You know, Yuan, when he makes jewelry, he needs to melt the silver and it gets really bad smoke from that. Uh, and he has just a little ventilation machine, I don't know what you call it, but it's not that good. Arvid, he's an electrician just as you want, but he's really good with the ventilation systems. So he came and fixed a really nice ventilation in the smithy. And we are so happy for that because I guess the most important part is to have a healthy environment when you work. Also, we had a really fun day. <laughs> I got to hang out with them and they are two really adorable kids, uh, Malte and Ola. You know, we don't really meet friends so often. <laughs> we, both me and Johan, are loners. You know, we like to, to be alone a lot. But sometimes it's just so nice to hang out with really good friends and, you know, laugh and talk. And yeah, I, we had a lot of fun and I really needed that. <laughs> I actually filmed a little bit during the day. So let's show you a little bit of what we did. Hey, Arvid Åsa! Hey! So, this is my best friends. Yes. It's a cool uh, You're one of our best friends too as well, I meant. <laughs> <laughs> Det gör något roligt, för fan det ser ut som en död fisk jobbar. Ska jag äta en glass till när vi Oh, now my favorite person on earth just woke up. Are you happy that you're gonna get good ventilation now? Very good job! Wow! 
Yeah, as you can see, we had a really nice Sunday. I always laugh so much when I'm with him, so it hurts in my stomach. <laughs> and now it's a new week and this week is a bit special because um, I'm not gonna has, have as much time to film this week as usual and that's because in about a week I'm gonna have my very first musical performance ever. I have to admit that I'm very nervous. <laughs> I mean, I really look forward to this. Um, I feel ready, but... <laughs> Sorry, it's a bird. So I feel ready, but it's still a very big thing for me because I'm gonna perform for a lot of people. And in this moment, I can't tell you more about this performance, but in about a week, I will definitely let you know all about it. <laughs> I just feel like I need to have some days now to focus and to practice, because I really want to feel comfortable. I want to feel as relaxed as I can, because I want to do a really good performance. I feel like I need to go into another mode. <laughs> I need to focus and I want to, you know, charge up for this performance. I probably won't film as much as usual this week, but hopefully me and Juwan are gonna get the key to our cottage uh, this week. So we will try to go to the cottage in the weekend. And of course I'm gonna film a lot when we do that. So I would try to make a video blog maybe at the end of this week or in the beginning of next week. But I don't know yet if we will get the keys, but I think so. Oh, and if you if you don't know what I'm talking about now, me and Joanne, we bought a little cottage up in the northern mountains here in Sweden. It's like about three hours from here. We did that about a month ago. So I still don't really understand that this is real. It's like too good to be true. <laughs> I really hope that we can go there this weekend. The sun is setting now and the mist is beginning to rise. It's so beautiful and it's getting a bit chilly in the air. It's like one degree Celsius now. So yeah, I just wanted to give you a little update on what's going on. And if you don't get any more videos from me during this week, then you know why. I'm preparing myself for a big step in my life. I hope you will all have a wonderful week and take care and I see you soon. No. Bye bye. Oh. Holy shit. Do you hear that echo?